Hello all, this is Madhukar Edivarna. I am AWS DevSecOps Center in VQ Software Solutions. Along with DevSecOps, I also teach MLOps and AOps. So today we are going to discuss how to increase the volume size without downtime. So if you ask me what is downtime, the server unavailable time is called downtime. Yes? So let's see this. How to increase volume size without server downtime yes so you have created a ec2 instance the ec2 instance having a volume which is 8 gb or 10 gb or 16 gb one find it definitely the 8 gb of the volume will be completed now definitely need to increase the volume size that too without downtime in real time. So if you want to see this, follow me. Okay, this is my AWS dashboard. I'm going to create a EC2 instance. Click here and then come here, open it. So once you are able to see the dashboard, I click on instance which are running. Now launch instance. The instance name I'm going to type it as ec2 hyphen instance hyphen increase increase volume size so come down uh, click on amazon linux and then just come down so create new key pair inc or EAS increase volume a create a PEM so once the PEM is created just just come down click on launch instance the launch instance is nothing but it's going to create an instance so once you're done with this come here so now click on this instance now go to your downloads part so come to the download so come here cut this go to your desktop uh, paste it and then just come here connect to the instance click on SH copy this come here right click Open git bash here. Come here. Okay. Say yes. So clear this. So sudo hyphen i. To check the what is the disk size, we need to say df hyphen h. So you are able to see the uh, disk size is 8 GB here, which is 1 GB is already used. And then you have 6.4 GB and all used percentage is 20 GB. If you want to increase the volume size, the first step you need to do is notepad. increase volume size in AWS the first point step one take a snapshot of EBS volume of EBS volume to be safe, safe. Step 2, increase the EBS volume size in AWS. Step 2, increase the 
volume size in AWS console. Step three. Step three. Extend a Linux file system. Lin in Linux file system after resizing the volume. Resizing the volume. So once you're done with this, now come here. Command to extend the file system. Command to extend the file system. C O M M. So let's say extend file system. So now, first of all, let's take the snapshot. Let's take the increase the volume size here. So come over here. Come here. You are able to see the volumes. So. You are able to see this, okay, EC2 instance, increase volume, this instance you need to take as snapshot, so come here, create a snapshot, description, so for volume increase, just come down, create a snapshot. So once you create a snapshot, go to snapshots. Uh, you are able to see for volume increase it is pending. Let's wait until it is completed and then we can go for the fights. So come here. We have just done with the, the first, first part. Take the snapshot of a EBS volume. We have to do that two more things. Just wait. It's still in pending. You need to wait until it is completed. So yes, it is completed. Now go to the instance. What is the volumes here? Click here. Which one? Yeah, second one. Okay, actions. You are able to see if the modify volume. So I'm going to increase until 16 GB. So come down, modify this. Click on modify. So once you modify this, let's go to this. Say DF. So it okay. It is going to and go to this dashboard. Come here, instance. So instance, connect, copy this, and then just paste it here. So sudo hyphen I clear. So next df hyphen h. Uh, still you are able to see the 8 GB only. Now we are going to use the commands. So command to extend the file system. Then it is df hyphen h t t t is nothing but type. T is nothing but type D like disk, F like free space, hyphen H like the human understandable language and T like type. So now come here, DF hyphen H and then T type. So now if you clearly observe this, so dev xvda1 xfs file system and then 8 GB is there. So now what we do is let us go and check the let us go and check the whether the volumes have a partition or not whether the volumes having partition or not so check the volume has a partition or not so now ls blk ls blk so clear this ls 
बी एल के सो इफ यू क्लियरली ऑब्जर्व दिस यू हैव ए एक्स डी ए वन इज ए जी बी एंड देन एक्स वी ए डी वन ट्वेंटी एट इज सो एट जी बी एंड देन एक्स वी ए इज सिक्सटीन जी बी यस सो नाउ वी आर गोइंग टू एक्सटेंड द पार्टीशन द कमेंड टू एक्सटेंड द पार्टीशन इज कमेंड टू एक्सटेंड द पार्टीशन एक्स टी एंड देन द partition is grow part g r o w grow p a r t part slash dev slash x v d a 1 copy this come here let's paste it so see this partition 1 start old size and then new size it is extended now let's go and see ls blk sorry uh, df hyphen h so you are still able to see only the 8 gb not the 16 gb so what we supposed to do is so clear this now extend the file system okay to extend the file system so come here file system on we are going to say if your file system is xfs file system xfs file system xfs underscore grow xfs hyphen d and then the directory is root directory so come here copy this paste it here so now if you able to see this data blocks change from this to this so now clear this say df hyphen h and then t so now you are able to see the 16 GB used 1 GB, 1.7 GB, and then 15 GB is there, and then use percentage is 11 percentage. This is how to increase volume size without downtime. Thank you.